Hello everyone thanks for watching this video. My name is Byron Fu, a second year master's student from Nanjing University. Today I'm going to talk about our work, Dual Side Deep Context Aware Modulation for Social Recommendation. Let us start with the research background. Recommender system, which is designed to filter information and provide personalized recommendations for users, playing a vital role in various web services nowadays. The most widely used recommendation methods are based on collaborative filtering techniques, which mainly make use of the user item interaction history, e.g., ratings, clicks. Moreover, along with the increasing popularity of social networking platforms, social recommendation, which incorporates social relations into recommender systems, has been developed and shows promising potential to improve recommendation performance. Social relations among users can provide friends information for modeling user preference better and also provide more possible perspectives for items exposure to relevant users. To incorporate social relations into the recommender system, existing social aware recommendation methods make several attempts in various ways. Social regularization methods assume that users who have social relations may have a similar preference. Thus, these methods consider social relations as a kind of social regularization to restrain the user embedding learning process. High-order social influence methods consider that connected people would influence each other based on the social influence theory. And these methods aggregate friends' influence to enhance the user preference. Context-aware social influence methods assume that friends' influence strength may be different when it comes to different candidate items and consider the candidate item as a specific context to model the friend's influence. However, the limitation of previous models is that they either ignore context information or only consider the shallow context when modeling user interests or item attraction. Such limitation would lead to limited user interests and item attraction. In fact, when modeling user side interests from users and friends historical interacted items, not only the information related to the candidate item can help, the information related to the candidate's similar items can also reflect the user's interests. And for the item attraction, if the item's past consumers are a friend of the targeted user or have a similar consumption habit to the target user, the item may be more attractive to the target users. Hence, it is obvious that considering the social relation and similarity relations among users helps to extract more useful information from the candidate item's interaction history. To tackle the issues mentioned above, in this paper, we propose Dicer which incorporating the high-order neighbor information to model the enhanced user preference and item attribute, and extracting the most related information from the interaction history based on the graph enhanced deep context. The proposed model consists of four modules, including the Graph Construction Module, GNN Module, Deep Context Aware Modulation Module, and Output Layers. The first is the Graph Construction Module. We define collaborative similar users as users who have similar consumption habits and collaborative similar items as items with similar clicks or rated history. And one way to calculate the collaborative similarity is by the common interaction history of the users. Then user U is collaborative similar to user V if and only if their collaborative similarity greater than a certain threshold, and the item's collaborative similarity relation is the same. The second is the GNN module. In order to exploit the high order relation and collaborative similarity relation, we propose a relation aware graph neural network, an extension of NGCF, which can efficiently aggregate and select the most related information from neighbors. By feeding the first layer inputs into three RGNN layers respectively, these layers can recursively model the propagation of item attributes or user preference in different graphs. The third is the Deep Context Aware Modulation Module. For user side interest, we consider the item's graph enhances representation Z as the deep context. By multiplying Z with each historical item of the user and then doing maximum pooling according to dimension, the user interest representation under this deep context can be obtained. Further, we calculate the interest of the target user and his friends in the candidate items, then calculate the influence strength through the attention mechanism. And the final user interest representation is obtained by the weighted sum of their interests. The last one is the output layer. Since the user's decision on candidate item depend on both user preference and item attribute, 
we firstly predict the score based on the graph enhanced representation of user and item. Then, the user's interest in the item and the item's attraction to the user reflect the matching score between the target user and the candidate item from two different perspectives. Then we predict another two matching scores based on the two perspectives to make the model more robust. For the experiment part, we conduct experiments on two representative datasets, Chow and Epinions, which are taken from popular social network websites. Each social networking service allows users to click items and add friends. Hence, they provide a large amount of rating information and social information. We adopt recall at K and NDCG at K to evaluate the performance of all methods. The two metrics have been widely used in previous recommendation studies. Recall at K considers whether the ground truth is ranked among the top K items, while NDCG at K is a position-aware ranking metric. To illustrate the effectiveness of our model, we compare Dicer with two classical collaborative filtering models, two social-based recommendation models, two deep learning-based recommendation models, and two deep learning-based social recommendation models. We further compared the major competitive models. For the social domain, we use S to represent the social information and HS to represent the high-order social information. For the item domain, we use I to represent the item information and HI to represent the high-order item information. For user interest and item attraction, we use SC to denote shallow context aware and DC denotes deep context aware. And we use DL to denote deep learning based methods. As shown in the table, Trust MF considers the social information and item information and Trust SVD further consider the shallow context aware user interest. NCF considers the item information and NGCF further consider the high order item information. SAMN is a deep learning method that considers the social, item information and shallow context aware user interest while DIFNET Plus considers the high order social information and item information. Our proposed model Dicer not only considers the high order social information and item information but also models the deep context aware user interests and item attraction. The comparison of different methods on two datasets is shown in Table 1. We set the length k equals 5, 10, and 15 in our experiments to evaluate on different recommendation lengths. From the results, the following observations can be made. First, methods incorporating social information generally perform better than non-social methods. For example, the performance of Trust SVD and Trust MF is better than BPR and FM, and SAMN, DIFNET++ and DICER outperform NGCF and NCF which indicates that social information is helpful to improve the recommendation performance. Second, our method DICER achieves the best performance on the two datasets. The substantial improvement of our model could be attributed to two reasons. The one is that our model uses relation-aware GNN to deal with the high-order social relation and collaborative similarity relation, which allow the related information from multi-relation neighbors to be utilized. Another is that we model the user's interests and items attraction based on the deep context, i.e., the graph-enhanced user and item representation. The proposed models provide dual-side modulation to capture the more diverse user interest and model the rich item attraction. To prove the effectiveness of the dual-side information, we compare Dicer with its two variants, Dicer without user interest, and Dicer without item attraction. The performance of Dicer and its variants on Chow and Epinions are given in Figure 1. From the results, we can find that the dual side information is important to predict the score and boost the recommendation performance. To get a better understanding of the proposed Dicer model, we further do some ablation studies for Dicer with different relations based context and the Dicer with attention. The results are shown in Table 2. We can find that the three relations all contribute to the deep context aware modulation for modeling the user interest and item attraction. The more relation the deep context is based on, the context aware information can be better for improving the performance. And the modulation function is more effective than the attention mechanism when model the related information from the interaction history. This may due to the max pooling operation in modulation is aiming to select the most similar feature which is more effective than the attention mechanism. 
Finally, our contributions can be summarized as follows. We propose a novel neural model for the social recommendation, which utilizes a relation-aware graph neural network to model multi-relation and high-order neighbor information effectively. And we designed a deep context-aware modulation module to model user-side interests and item-side attraction. The experiments on two real-world benchmark datasets are conducted to demonstrate the effectiveness of our model. We show that our model consistently outperforms the state-of-the-art models.